Are you recording or is Caleb recording? Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs>
Another great round of applause for Mr. and Mrs. Emily and Taylor Tammy. Quiere llorar, quiere llorar. Oh, thank you. Because you're beautiful. Everything about you is beautiful. And because you're beautiful, you should be beautiful. And we have a beautiful dog. The next people, like I said, get very emotional. Um, I want you guys to know these people, they mean a lot to me. It is Peter and Sue. They sit right here with my wife. Those are Dominique's, uh, she calls them Parino and Marina. Those are her godparents. They've been with me since Dominique, before Dominique was even we was thinking about having an, uh, another child. They did with me. Um, and if it was for them, I don't know, there's a lot of things. That's why he's my best friend. I'm a grown man. And he's a grown man, but he's always been my best friend. Um, thank you, Peter Zuma. And thank you for helping me make this happen. Thank you. I'm going to continue. And this person was crying a lot this morning. He tried to blame me that I'm the emotional one, but it's Pastor Jeffrey. Pastor Jeffrey's my friend. He's been a person that I've always called my spiritual father. He's been with me through some times rough, mentally and spiritually. But this is not about me, it's about my daughter. And why I'm thinking is it because he loves my daughter how I love my daughter. I, I can count on that. Just like Peter loves my daughter like that. Jeffrey, gracias. Gracias, Janiri, um, tu esposa. Gracias porque ustedes siempre han estado ahí cuando los necesito. Gracias. Then, of course, my boys, Joseph. Wow. We did it. <laughs> and she did it. You did it already? Um, well, you already know? <laughs> Nikita. Um, we call Nikita, the reality is Nikita, because of a, a Nikita, a small doll. So from the time she was born, my wife called her Nekita, but everybody stuck to Nekita, so she's, had, she's got friends who call her Nekita, so we call her Nekita with love. Nekita, Dominique, mommy, you are a gift from God. You are a gift from God. I love you. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of the woman you have become, and I know you're going to continue to make us proud. David, my man. My nigga. <laughs> no. No, it's not like that. A lot of people think it's like that. It's not like that. I remember when Damon came to my house with his mom. I think they were going to homecoming. If I, I can't. But I, I do remember he was wearing. He was wearing all black with a gold chain. He looked really young. Maybe 11th grade or 10th grade. But they were going to the homecoming dance. The way you looked at her, I fell in love with you. <laughs> and I told my wife, I'm not lying, I told her. I fell in love with you. Because I saw the joy in you on how much you loved her and you guys were still young. I love you, brother. And you are part of all right. Um, I want to thank everybody. Everyone that's here is special to us in some way, somehow. I have family members. Dominique has friends. Damon has family members. You guys mean a lot. 
And if you made that sacrifice to come here, wow. I don't know how to thank you. Because that means a lot. Just taking your time to join us for this beautiful day. I want to finish it up. I don't want to talk too much because I do get sentimental, but I just want to finish it up with a Bible verse in 1 Corinthians 13, 13 that says, So now faith, hope, and love abide. These three, but the greatest of these is love. Love conquers everything. Nothing comes between God. I love you guys. I wish you the best, and I'm going to be there the whole time. So everybody know, I'm going to be there the whole time. <laughs> Thank you. Everyone.